So in this tutorial, I'm going to show you how to split text into multiple columns. So in this case, I'm going to be splitting this email column into multiple texts. And I'm going to be using the delimiter function in Excel. And the delimiter is the at symbol. So I'm going to be creating another column here with username. And the username is going to be the first part before the at symbol. So to do that, I'm going to select email entire column here. On the ribbon tab, I'm going to click on data. And on the right side, this is the button text to column. And when you hover the mouse over it, it gives you a box with explanations here. You can split a single column of text into multiple columns. So I click on this text to columns. Now this box appears. Delimited is selected as the default. There's also fixed width and the delimiter is the at symbol. So this is the column that I selected and this is the preview of the column. So I'll click next. By default, the delimiters are set at tab. Now you have a list of delimiters here, a semicolon, comma, space, and there's other. So I'll select other because I want to use the at delimiter. So I'll select other and I'm going to insert the at symbol here. This is how the preview shows. This is the data preview. Click next. So the destination says it's going to insert the data in the B column and I don't want to overwrite this column so I want it on C column so I'm just going to delete the B type C and click finish and this is how it shows so the first part of the email before the at sign shows up here and this is what I want so all I have to do is rename this email to username so I don't want this column so all I have to do is select all and hit delete so I thank you for watching I ask you to subscribe